Hello, I'm Alyssa Kleisler and I teach the dual credit Spanish classes with the Prince William Sound College at the high school. And today I'd like to honor two students in my Spanish 2 class. At first I'll speak in Spanish and then I will speak in English. La primera estudiante Es una estudiante a pesar de sus desafíos, este estudiante nunca se rinde. No es fácil para ella, pero a ella no le importa. Es respetuosa y siempre tiene una sonrisa brillante. Entonces, nunca se rinde y mm, siempre me respondía en español. Me ha sorprendido cuánto podía recordar y comprender en mis clases. Y por esas razones, razones yo presento a la estudiante Rose Johnson, otherwise known as Emma, este certificado de excelencia en mi clase de español. Y también este libro, Brandon Brown, hace trampa porque a Emma o a Rose le gustan mucho los libros, o, uh, le gustan mucho los libros de Brandon Brown. Entonces, felicitaciones a Emma. La segunda, oh, in English. <laughs> Entonces, so my first student is, despite all of her difficulties and challenges, this student never gives up. And she always surprises me. Her, she always responds to me in Spanish. And her memory of how much she can understand in my classes and also respond really uh, is outstanding to me. She's very respectful and she always has a beautiful smile on her face. And for those reasons, I award Rose Johnson this Certificate of Excellence in my Spanish classes, along with this book, Brandon Brown, Hace Trampa, which is he is going to be playing some jokes on people. And Rose really enjoyed Brandon Brown Brown's books in my classes. And uh, so she has one of her own. Ok, vamos a la segunda estudiante. Y entonces, uh, aprender una lengua extranjera implica más que solamente las reglas de gramática. Y este estudi estudiante no solo demuestra la habilidad de escribir y hablar muy fluido, en español, sino y además muestra su capacidad de tener la empatía y un entendimiento de la cultura y su gente. Tiene un interés auténtico en la lengua y su cultura. Tiene una curiosidad para los costumbres y no las rechaza, sino las abraza. Por esas razones, yo presento a Zaya Taylor, otherwise known as Clara, este certificado de excelencia en mi clase de español y también para ser una estudiante trabajadora, curiosa y respetuosa que uh, sobrepasa el nivel de español 2 y demuestra que es capaz de acoger una cultura extranjera. Yo tengo también para ella un libro y se llama The Day It Snowed Tortillas. Y es de narrador Joe Hayes. Es un narrador muy uh, estimado. Y yo quiero decir a Zaya también que espero, y a Rose, espero que... Ustedes siempre tengan interés en otras culturas y viajen a menudo por el mundo. 
Entonces, so in English, uh, so learning a language involves much more than just the rules of grammar. And this student demonstrates the ability, she demonstrated her ability of writing and speaking very fluidly in Spanish, but also, and moreover, she demonstrated her capacity of having empathy for and an understanding for the culture and its people. She has a genuine interest in the culture. She's curious about the customs and she doesn't um, push them away, she embraces them. And for these reasons, I present Zaya Taylor with this certificate of excellence in my Spanish classes as well as for being a uh, hardworking, curious, and very respectful student who has passed the second year Spanish level and has shown that is, she is capable of uh, welcoming a uh, foreign culture. And the book that she'll, she's receiving is The Day It Snow Tortillas by Joe Hayes. And it is a selection of um, stories that have been passed down more by word of mouth than um, in writing. And I wish both of these girls, uh, or I hope that both of these girls will continue to always have such uh, a vigorous interest in foreign cultures and uh, that they get to travel the world. So, muchas gracias. Thank you very much. Y adios.